हेलो एवरी वन वेलकम टू माई न्यू चैनल वंडर्स ऑफ जोलॉजी एफ आई बी एस सी जोलॉजी स्टूडेंट एंड कोर्स वन सेमिस्टर वन आई एम डॉक्टर सुखदा जांबे असोसिएट प्रोफेसर फ्रॉम एस एच केड़कर कॉलेज देवगढ़ सिंधुदुर्ग टूडेज टॉपिक ऑफ माई लेक्चर इज इकोलोकेशन फ्रॉम यूनिट वन दैट इज वंडर्स ऑफ एनिमल वर्ल्ड in which ecolocation in bat in and cetaceans that includes dolphin and whales will consider in this lecture first of all we'll consider what is eco and ecolocation actually eco is reflection of sound after hitting an object and ecolocation is a property of using eco to determine where objects are in the space in other words with the help of echoes brain draws image of objects therefore we can um, explain in short about the principle of echolocation as the echolocating bats emit sound pulses that is clicks of very high frequency the listen of the returning echoes to form a auditory scene echolocation is auditory mechanism in animals such as mammals and birds a behavior in which animals emit calls and then listen to the echoes that bounce back of solid things in the environment in this mechanism an animal emits high frequency sound pulses and uses the returning echoes to detect direction distance size and texture of object in its environment this behavior can be used to navigate and find food or for gaining mates it is the biological analog of the sonar system used by submarines sonar means a system of the detection of object and for measuring the depth of water it works by emitting sound pulses and measuring how long it takes the echo to return to the particular point again this sonar like use of auditory signal is developed to its maximum in two groups of mammals one microchiropterans bats and the second one some cetaceans such as porpoises and dolphins echolocation in bats will consider first bats means the mammals that belongs to the phylum chordata bats navigate by detecting echoes of sounds from their wing beats and locate their prey by homing in and in on buzzing of the insect wings bats emit ultrasound cries and use echoes echoes of those sounds to see in the dark ultrasound means sounds at frequencies above the range that can be easily detected by human ear radar means radio detection and ranging which is similar to use um, similar to bat use for aerial eco aerial echolocation means echolocation in air echolocation in bats bats navigate by detecting echoes of sound from their wing beats and then uh, it is observed with a high speed photography that bat using echolocation can capture two separate insect within half second the mechanism of echolocation is uh, shown in this diagram where insect uh, on the insect the um, sound which is produced by the bat it uh, strike and again it forms the um, uh, returning uh, echo waves bats uh, use ultrasound waves with frequencies up to 1 lakh hertz to move around and hunt as bat fly they send out short impulses of ultrasound waves these pulses which are sent by the bat they are of about 200 pulses per second ultrasound waves reflect off uh, of the object and return back to the bat's ear the time which is taken for the sound to return to the bat lets the bat know how far the object is therefore uh, the phases of echolocation means cruising phase detection phase homing phase to home in on the prey the there are four steps in prey capturing by 
बैट वन इज द सर्च ऑफ द प्रे अनदर इज एप्रोच थर्ड वन इज द ट्रैकिंग ऑफ द प्रे प्रे एंड फोर्थ वन इज कैप्चर ऑफ द प्रे इनिशियली द साउंड प्रोड्यूस बाय बैट इज ऑफ हाई इंटेंसिटी कंपेर्ड विद द साउंड दैट रिटर्न एज इको इन बैट मार्फोलॉजिकल एंड न्यूरोनल मॉडिफिकेशन हेल्प इन डिटेक्टिंग द इकोज मार्फोलॉजिकल मॉडिफिकेशन आर एज फॉलोज इट्स नाउट इज कवर्ड बाय कॉम्प्लेक्स फोल्ड्स नॉस्ट्रिल्स आर स्पेस टू प्रोड्यूस ए मेगाफोन इफेक्ट द पिनी आर व्हेरी लार्ज एंड हेल्प टू कैप्चर एनी इकोज इयरडम एंड इयर ऑसिकल्स आर स्मॉल एंड लाइट ड्यूरिंग इमिशन ऑफ साउंड muscles controlling auditory ossicles contract thereby reducing sensitivity of ear echolocation is used by cetaceans also therefore in the second part we'll consider echolocation in cetaceans echolocation is used by all odontocetes that is toothed whales and dolphins to detect obstacle and prey production of sound in odontocetes is associated with upper nasal passages situated ventral to blow hole the basic sound production system includes a pair of phonic lips surrounded by fat filled bursae suspended by muscles and ligaments below the blow hole the air is forced through the slit opens and echolocation clicks are produced when the slits are slapped shut subsequently causing vibrations the melon organ help to propagate the sound forward thus focusing the sound wave into a beam under water now we'll consider the uses of the sound waves vibrations and to uh, which are used to detect the object specifically high pitch gaur sound give echoes with information about position size distance shape speed and even texture of an object for example if an echo is faint the object is supposed to be small if the echo is high pitch the object is moving toward the dolphin known as doppler effect as a side note doppler effect is where a sound mo uh, moving towards you is higher higher pitch and under uh, and louder than the sound moving away from you for example imagine a police car as its siren is on it is behind you but you pull over the road of the, uh, the side of the road to let it go after someone else it weeps by you and as it moves away the siren is quieter and lower this is because there are less sound waves per unit time reaching your ear how echolocation works in dolphin first a sound is generated by moving air around the sinuses then it bounces the water molecules around and hits an object the wave is then reflected back in an echo in which dolphin a dolphin is estimated to pick up in the fat filled cavity in the lower jaw which then makes its way to the ear from lower jaw dolphins use this ability to detect their surroundings whether it is food or the ocean floor or each other that means the another dolphin this is the diagram of the bottle nose dolphin that exhibit how echolocation takes place from dolphin the echolocation clicks are produced that strike or beats the uh, target target and then again comes as the echo of clicks with melon organ and uh, ear and then how the image is formed in the brain cetacean uh, ear serves as the separate hydrophones that allows the animal to localize an echo and discriminate between the time the sound is received by each ear sound transmitted through water cause vibration that are transmitted by the entire skull if the middle and inner ear bones are attached rigidly to the skull vibration would reach the ear from many directions simultaneously thus allowing localization of the sound the tympanic bully are not fused to the skull in cetaceans 
होम फिल्ड सायनसेस सराउंड द बुली दस इफेक्टिवली इन्शुलेटिंग द बुली फ्रॉम द रेस्ट ऑफ द स्कल इन एडिशन द एक्सट्रीमली थीन पोस्टेरियर पार्ट ऑफ द लोअर जॉ दॅट ॲक्ट्स ॲज द अकॉस्टिकल विंडो साऊंड पासेस थ्रू द थीन पार्ट ऑफ दिस बोन टू द इंट्रा मेंडिब्युलर फॅट बॉडी डिरेक्टली लिडिंग टुवर्ड्स द वॉल ऑफ द ऑडिटरी बुला द जॉ इज द मोस्ट अकॉस्टिकली सेन्सिटिव्ह एरिया ऑफ द डॉल्फिन्स हेड देर फोर वी कॅन कन्क्लूड इन अवर लास्ट स्लाईड दॅट इज देर आर सम ॲनिमल्स हु हॅव डेव्हलप प्रॉपर्टी टू इको लोकेट ऑब्जेक्ट विदाऊट हेल्प ऑफ द व्हिजन हाऊ ॲनिमल कॅन इको लोकेट दॅट इज फर्स्ट ऑफ ऑल साऊंड इज प्रोड्यूस बाय द ॲनिमल दॅन दॅन दॅट साऊंड ट्रॅव्हल्स टू द मीडिया व्हॉट एव्हर इट मे बी इट मे बी वॉटर ऑर द एअर दॅट इज एरियल ट्रान्समिशन ऑफ द साऊंड वेव दॅन इट स्ट्राईक द ऑब्जेक्ट अँड फॉर्मेशन ऑफ द इको टेक्स प्लेस द इको लोकेटिंग इको लोकेटिंग ॲनिमल्स क्राय लाऊड सो दॅट देअर साऊंड बिकम इको आफ्टर हिटिंग द टार्जेट वॉट ए बॅट कॅन डिटेक्ट बाय युझिंग इको लोकेशन फर्स्ट वन दॅट इज डिस्टन्स ऑर द रेंज बाय कम्पेअरिंग द टाईम ऑफ इमिटेड पल्स टू द टाईम ऑफ रिटर्निंग इको सेकंड वन दॅट इज द साईज ऑफ द ऑब्जेक्ट लार्जर द ॲनिमल रिफ्लेक्ट मोर साऊंड वेव ऑफ द हाय इंटेन्सिटी अँड स्मॉलर ॲनिम इन केस ऑफ स्मॉलर ॲनिमल दे कॅन रिफ्लेक्ट लेस साऊंड ऑफ द लो इंटेन्सिटी थर्ड वन इज द मुमेंट बाय कम्पेअरिंग द अमाऊंट ऑफ द एको ऑपटेंड ऑन द राईट अँड लेफ्ट साईड ऑफ द इयर then fourth one is the velocity by taking advantage of the doppler shift echo of higher frequency means target is gaining then second one echo of the lower intensity means target is outstanding that's all we'll consider all the points during this lecture of the echo location in bats thank you for watching my lecture share this video for the benefit of the maximum students have a Uh, good day